Simon Sear and draw a Christmas creeper. Yeah, a creeper with a Christmas hat or a Santa hat. We hope you're gonna follow along with us. You need your art supplies. We're gonna use a marker to draw with. You also need some paper and something to go with. Yeah, you ready to start? Yeah. Let's first draw our creeper's mouth. We're gonna draw an upside down little kind of square U shape. So we're gonna go up, over, and down. And we're just drawing a cartoon version. Um, yeah, this is gonna be really funny. Yeah. There we go. And then we're gonna draw a line coming out to the left and also out to the right. Then we're gonna draw a line down that's a little bit longer on each side. Then we're gonna draw a short line in that matches the line above it. So we're gonna stop right above. Yes, just like that. And then we're gonna come up, over, and across, just like we did on the top. And we'll color that in black later. But let's draw the eyes next. We're gonna draw a big square shape. I'm gonna draw a letter L. And then we're gonna draw an upside down L to connect the top. Then we're gonna do the same thing over here for the same size I. We'll draw the letter L to match, and then we'll draw an upside down L to complete the square. Nice. Now let's draw a little square in the top left. So I'm gonna draw a backwards L on both eyes. This is for the highlight. Let's color in the big square, but leave that little square white, and then also color in the mouth. Now this part will fast forward, so remember to pause the video and take time to color in these shapes on your drawing. Now we're gonna draw the shape of our creeper's head. We're gonna start here on the left side. We're gonna come down, across, and then we're gonna come back up to match. Whoop. I got a little bumpy. That's okay, right? We're practicing. Yeah. The most important thing is... To have fun. Yeah, to have fun. And it's okay if your drawings look different than ours. Both of our drawings look different. Because the other most important thing is... To practice. Yeah, have fun and practice. We hope you're having a lot of fun too. All right, let's keep going. Now let's draw the Christmas hat or Santa hat on top. I'm going to draw a bumpy line. So I'm going to draw some of the bumps little and some of them big. Oh, well, it kind of looks like water this way, right? Yeah. And we're going to connect all the way over to the right side. Then we're going to draw the top of, this is the fluffy part of our Santa hat. I'm going to draw a curve that comes out, and then I'm going to draw bumps kind of coming up, and we'll do the same thing. <laughs> this is a really big, fluffy part of our Santa hat. Yeah. <laughs> I love how big it's getting. Almost looks like our creeper has hair. <laughs> yeah. Now we're going to draw the top. We're going to draw big and little bumps to connect over to the other side. Now we're gonna draw the top of our Santa hat. We're gonna start over here, and we're gonna draw a curve that comes up, over, and then we're gonna come out to the side, past the fluffy part. Yeah. And then we're gonna draw a curve going this way, but we wanna leave some space up here. We don't wanna connect. Yeah, and then we're gonna start here, make a point, and then connect to this curve on the right side. Now let's draw the little pom-pom. On the end, we're gonna draw a popcorn shape. I'm gonna draw little bumps and big bumps all the way around to make a little circle shape. Looks like a piece of popcorn. We did it, there's our creeper head. Now let's draw the body. And we're gonna draw it kinda of small. We're gonna draw two lines coming down on each side of the mouth. So from the chin down. Then we're gonna draw the legs. I'm gonna start here. We're gonna draw a line that comes across like this on both sides. Oh, this side got a little bit bigger. That's okay. Yes, and then we're gonna draw two lines coming straight down in the middle. And then we're gonna draw a slightly diagonal line on the left and then a diagonal line going the other way on the right. Oh, and I love that you connected oh. the bottom. Yeah, that's what I'm doing too. We're gonna connect the bottom to complete the shape. And then we're also gonna draw the bottom of the body, a little line that comes across like that. Let's draw one more thing for a creeper. What do they like? What would they like underneath the Christmas tree? TNT. Yeah, probably TNT. <laughs> we're gonna draw a line that comes out from behind the leg on the left. Then we'll draw a line up and then over 
and then I'm going to draw it coming down. Yeah, and then let's draw two lines across the middle. Then we're going to write TNT inside of here. But first, we're going to write it kind of weird. I'm going to write the letter N right in the middle of the box, right in the center. That way, it's spaced out evenly. Then on the left, we're going to add the letter T, and also on the right, the letter T. Then let's also add a bow, since it's kind of like a present. <laughs> so we'll draw an upside down little square shape, then we'll draw a diagonal line up and then down, and a diagonal line on this side up and down. Awesome, we did it! We finished our Christmas Creeper, except we're not completely done. We still need to color it! Yeah, this is my favorite part. Let's pick out the colors first. We're using our Art for Kids Hub markers. That's okay if you don't have the same set. You can use other markers, or you could use different art supplies like colored pencils or even oil pastels. Now, the colors that we have picked out are 59 and 46. Those are two different greens, a light green and a darker green. Then we have two different reds, 11 and 2. We also have 66 blue and CG1, which is a gray color. Now first, let's start with our light green, 59, and color in our creeper solid. Then we'll also use 11, our red color, for the Santa hat and also the TNT. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. You're doing a great job, Austin. Keep going. Oh, you want to use red yeah. down here on the TNT. I'm switching to my darker green, 46. I'm going to add a little shadow underneath the hat right here to make it look more 3D. I'm also going to use this green to add some of the pixel texture to the creeper. Now I'm using number two, a dark red, to add texture lines to the TNT box. I also use the dark green for the bow. Oh, and I love that you use the blue on the fluffy part of the Santa hat. I'm going to do that also. Awesome, we did it! We finished drawing and coloring our funny Christmas creepers. Did you have fun? Yeah. I especially love how it looks all colored in. Me too, I hope our friends will color their drawings also. Yeah, you can pause the video right now to match our same coloring. You could also add different things, like maybe a Christmas tree or even a Minecraft background. Yeah, you can also add more TNT presents. <laughs> that would be awesome. Maybe one's exploding. <laughs> yeah, we hope you had a lot of fun drawing a Christmas creeper. We do, we hope you had a lot of fun and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.